Question 1. What does a single solid yellow line on a road indicate? Option A. The center of a road with two-way traffic. Option B. A lane barrier between regular and preferential use lanes. Option C. Separation between two lanes going in the same direction. The correct answer is Option A. The center of a road with two-way traffic. Question 2. What does a solid yellow line on your side of the road mean? Option A. Passing is allowed. Option B. Passing is not allowed. Option C. Passing is allowed only in certain circumstances. The correct answer is Option B. Passing is not allowed. A solid yellow line on your side of the road indicates that passing is not allowed. It is used on two way roads to mark the center line, and crossing it to pass another vehicle is illegal. Question 3. What does a broken yellow line indicate? Option A. A lane barrier between regular and preferential use lanes. Option B. The center of a road with two-way traffic. Option C. You may pass if the broken line is next to your driving lane. The correct answer is Option C. You may pass if the broken line is next to your driving lane. A broken yellow line on the road indicates that passing is allowed in that lane, but drivers should still exercise caution and only pass when it is safe to do so. Passing over a broken yellow line should be done with caution and only when there is good visibility and no oncoming traffic. Question 4. What does a single solid white line indicate? Option A. The center of a road with two-way traffic. Option B. Separation between two lanes going in the same direction. Option C. A lane barrier between regular and preferential use lanes. The correct answer is Option B. Separation between two lanes going in the same direction. A single solid white line marks traffic lanes going in the same direction. Drivers should stay within their lane and should not cross over the solid white line, except in certain situations such as when it is necessary to avoid an obstacle in the road. Question 5. What does a broken white line on the road mean? Option A. Passing is allowed. Option B. Passing is not allowed. Option C. Passing is allowed only in certain circumstances. The correct answer is Option A. Passing is allowed. A broken white line on the road indicates that passing is allowed, but only when it is safe to do so. It is often used on multi-lane roads to separate lanes of traffic traveling in the same direction. Question 6. What do double solid white lines indicate? Option A. A lane barrier between regular and preferential use lanes. Option B. Separation between two lanes going in the same direction. Option C. A lane for emergency vehicles only. The correct answer is Option A. A lane barrier between regular and preferential use lanes. Double solid white lines indicate a lane barrier between a regular use and a preferential use lane, such as a carpool or HOV lane. These lanes are reserved for vehicles carrying multiple occupants or other authorized vehicles. Never change lanes or cross over double solid white lines to enter or exit an HOV lane, except where specifically designated by a broken white line. Question 7. What does a 
a double solid yellow line on the road mean? Option A. Passing is allowed on both sides of the road. Option B. Passing is allowed only on one side of the road. Option C. Passing is not allowed on either side of the road. The correct answer is Option C. Passing is not allowed on either side of the road. A double yellow line on the road is used to mark the center line on two-way roads where it is not safe to pass. Question 8. What does a white diamond painted on the road mean? Option A. High occupancy vehicle, HOV lane. Option B. Pedestrian crossing. Option C. Bike lane. The correct answer is Option A. High occupancy vehicle HOV lane. A white diamond painted on the road indicates that the lane is reserved for high occupancy vehicles, such as buses or cars carrying multiple passengers. These lanes are designed to encourage carpooling and reduce traffic congestion. Question 9. On a multi-lane road, with lanes separated by single solid white lines. Option A. Passing is allowed. Option B. Passing is not allowed. Option C. Passing is allowed only in certain circumstances. The correct answer is Option B. Passing is not allowed. A solid white line on the road indicates that passing is not allowed. It is used to mark the edge of the roadway or to separate lanes of traffic traveling in the same direction. Crossing a solid white line is illegal, except when entering or exiting a driveway or parking lot. Question 10. Which of these is illegal U-turn? Option A. On a divided highway where there is a paved opening for a turn. Option B. 150 feet away from a hill or curve. Option C. Over two sets of double yellow lines in the roadway. The correct answer is Option C. Over two sets of double yellow lines in the roadway. It is generally illegal to make a U-turn over two sets of double yellow lines in the roadway. Double yellow lines indicate that it is unsafe to pass or cross, and making a U-turn over them can be dangerous and cause accidents. Question 11. If there are two solid yellow lines dividing opposite lanes of traffic, you may Option A. Cross over the lines to make a left turn from or into a side street. Option B. Cross over the lines to pass another vehicle as long as a no passing sign is not posted. Option C. Not cross over these lines for any reason. The correct answer is Option C. Not cross over these lines for any reason. Solid yellow lines indicate that it is not safe to pass and that you may not cross over the lines to change lanes, turn, or pass another vehicle. Question 12. You may cross double yellow lines to pass another vehicle, if that. Option A. Vehicle in front of you, move to the right to let you pass. Option B. Yellow line next to your side of the road is broken. Option C. Yellow line next to the other side of the road is broken. The correct answer is Option B. Yellow line next to your side of the road is broken. You may cross over double yellow lines to pass another vehicle only when the line next to your side of the road is broken. You may pass only if it is safe to do so and there are no obstructions in your way. Always make sure to check for oncoming traffic and proceed with caution when crossing over yellow lines. Question 13. You are driving at 55 miles per hour on a two-lane highway 
one lane in each direction, and want to pass the vehicle ahead of you. To pass safely, you need to. Option A. Wait until solid double yellow lines separate the lanes. Option B. Increase your speed to at least 60 miles per hour. Option C. Have a large enough gap in the oncoming traffic. The correct answer is Option C. Have a large enough gap in the oncoming traffic. Passing another vehicle on a two-lane road can be dangerous and should only be done when it is safe to do so. The driver should wait until they have a clear view of the road ahead and there is a large enough gap in the oncoming traffic to safely pass. The driver should also use their turn signal, check their blind spots, and make sure they have enough time and space to safely pass the other vehicle. Question 14 You are driving on a five-lane freeway in the lane closest to the center divider. To exit the freeway on the right you should Option A Carefully cross all the lanes at one time Option B Change lanes, one at a time until you are in the proper lane. Option C. Slow down before beginning each lane change. The correct answer is. Option B. Change lanes, one at a time until you are in the proper lane. When exiting the freeway on the right, you should change lanes safely, one at a time, until you are in the proper lane to exit. Crossing all the lanes at once is dangerous and not recommended. Thank you for practicing with us. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more practice videos to help you easily pass the DMV written test. Please visit our website www.dmv-permit-practice-test.com for more resources to help you prepare for the test.